So we're about an hour into the show here in the morning, and uh, it's so cool to see so many great familiar faces. Uh, we got to bump into a couple great people already. Uh, checking out the brands. A lot going on. We were walking fast because we had to get to a, another booth here. Yeah. But uh, what do you think about Equip Expo every time? It's always bigger than I remember. Like. I heard that before. But anyway, <laughs> what else you got besides that? That's it. That's all I got. That's it? That's it. It, it, it really does feel like a family reunion. Um, that's the best part about Equip Expo. You see friends, family. I know it sounds weird, but like when you've been doing this for 10, 20 years, and you start seeing all your familiar friends, your friends from social media, so many of you guys, uh, it's just a really, really good time, and I'm just honored to be part of this industry and community. It's so cool. So, all right. That being said, it's like work time. Let's go. I want to get as much footage for you guys as possible. So, you guys are enjoying the videos. Big thumbs up. You guys know what it is. Appreciate all of the support for everybody who stops by this week and says hey as well. So, I'm not really like an outgoing people person. So I'm like doing my best. You say that all the time. I don't. Emily from X Mark and I were talking about that, and we don't believe that. I hey, don't believe that. I'm more introverted, but. Let's keep going, let's keep going, let's rock and roll. All right, so again, really quick, I wanna show you guys a brand that you guys might know a little bit about. My beautiful wife and Brandon Bull. Adam, where are you at at your booth? My brother's not here yet. He is a newborn, he's getting some sleep. Yeah, Adam probably, uh, yeah, exactly, exactly. First time away from his newborn uh, baby, and so he's probably uh, sleeping in, drooling on himself. Adam does uh, websites, branding, marketing, SEO. You guys have heard me talk about Adam and Brandon Bull. They just launched their 100th green industry website like two weeks ago. That's so cool. That is really cool for a brand that's not even 18 months old, two years old, like they're crushing it. Uh, so if you guys need websites, marketing, branding, brandonbull.com, tell them we sent you. Adam and his uh, partner, Lauren, are killing it, so it's awesome. I but, just take a photo and give it Yeah, just, yeah, where, where are you at, Adam? Let's go, good morning. All right, guys, really quick, over here at the Crest booth, just want to do a quick little pan, show you guys everything that's going on over here. Obviously, you've probably been seeing our uh, demo trailer video that we're doing with them, the seven or 10 day trailer challenge. It's actually really fun, and <laughs> go figure, watch me end up buying a bunch of stuff from Crest, but that's probably not a bad thing either. All right, let's check it out really quick. We got the trimmer lineup over here. We've got some handheld blowers. I just wanna show you guys this really quick. Uh, I will tell you guys, this trimmer right here, my guys absolutely love. You got the motor on the end, right, going all the way down. And then you couple that with the nano battery, they love it. The thicker battery is a little heavier, admittedly, but it's still very well balanced, like they've said. I'm telling you, not only was my guys grabbing that one, that's the one I was grabbing. All right, so pretty awesome. We got their backpack blow over here. There you go. And I know a lot of you guys have seen this, but some of you guys have been adopting and having that conversation about battery. This is the eight minute quick charge, right? That goes with the cyber tank. So there you go. And then while we're on the go for all day work, I'm sure you guys this really quick. Look at that thing. Awesome. All right. Well, I uh, will have a uh, debrief. We've had a two week tra trailer challenge, but almost for a month now. Uh, they actually just said, hey, if you want to hold on to it for a little bit longer, you're totally fine with that. So I'm super grateful for that. Uh, our local rep just had a spare trailer with all the Crest stuff, so that's really nice. But in about a week, week and a half, I'm going to give you guys a debrief on our thoughts on the Crest platform. And so far, it's pretty awesome. So, all right, let's keep going. All right, guys, so coming at you here really quick. Uh, BJ, all the way from beautiful. Where are you from, brother? I'm from Brisbane, Australia. You can't tell with the, uh, the accent. I know how to talk to people from Australia because my kids are infatuated with Bluey. <laughs> And so, my, I wish my daughter was here right now to meet somebody with an actual Australian accent. I'm, I'm infatuated with Bluey. I love the show. It's who, do, who doesn't love Bluey, all right? Yeah. Uh, if you guys have kids, you know, what, you know, you know. If you are 21 and you don't have kids, you're like, what are these guys talking about? 100%. There you go. Uh, <laughs> really quick, you were telling me you're all the way from Australia. Yes. Proud of you for making the trip all the way over here. Thank you. Um, you guys are trying to get this going back at home, so talk to me for like 30 seconds. What do you got going on? Okay, so we've got the Lawn and Land Equip Expo. It's abbreviated to Ellie to make it a little bit easier. But yeah, we uh, we don't really have a green industry expo in Australia, and we thought, who better to do it than us? And my wife and I have teamed up, and uh, yeah, she's she's amazing. She's the brains of the operation on the face, as you can tell. And uh, yeah, we just get it done. We did three shows this year, Sydney, Melbourne, and Brisbane. Next year, we're gonna do one big show over two days in Melbourne. So uh, stay tuned, and yeah, I can't wait. That is so cool. Uh, my podcast downloads Fullerton Unfiltered Podcast, which you were on. Yep. Uh, I did a banger show. I uh, It's always fun because I'm usually shooting those at midnight my time for like 8 a.m. your time. Yes. yes. Or, or the opposite because you guys are on the other end of the world. Yep. Um, but also, uh, you guys 
have so much great stuff going on with uh, that whole neck of the woods. You yeah. get, you're a Skag ambassador. I am, I am, and Bush Ranger Australia as well. Yeah. So yeah, it's it's fantastic. Don't forget to tune into Lawn Care Skull Sessions as well. I do a podcast with uh, Ben Van de Geesen from Catch Pro Australia. Shout out to Ben. Yeah, shout out to Ben. Well, the uh, the whole thing with the, the podcast is US is our number one downloads. I think Canada is obviously probably number two. Yep. And I think Australia, you guys are holding in there as number three. Yes. And thank you so much for helping us rank on the charts, whatever that does for anything. I don't know. But thank you for the love over in Australia. Well, thank you. You kicked it off. I, I remember starting my business and Keith Galfus was the first video I watched on YouTube. Love Keith. And then all your stuff came second. So yeah, it was awesome. That's awesome, man. Hey, what's uh, one thing you're looking forward at the show? Uh, definitely seeing what Skag have. Uh, I definitely was looking forward to catching up with all the, the American crew like yourself. Uh, Paul Jamison hopefully is here somewhere. Yeah, yeah. Um, John yeah. Deere booth. John Deere booth. Alright, sweet. Last I got year you. was at the Toro booth. Yep. Alright, sweet. Well, I'll know I think John Deere wrote a bigger check, you know? Yeah. Fair enough. <laughs> just, yeah. just saying, you know what I'm saying? But, good. With the Expos, I know a lot of the distributors here and a lot of the Australian distributors are running around, so I'll go and catch up with them and I can't wait to party. Alright, brother. Yeah, party. <laughs> I love the accent. Alright. Hey, appreciate you. Awesome, man. Have a good Thanks, show. Man. All right, guys. So really quick, we're over at the Earthway booth. Mitch, what's up, brother? How are you? Oh. Good. How are you doing? It's good seeing you. Hey, um, for anybody who doesn't know Earthway, no big picture, obviously, but uh, walk me through the product line. I, I, I love you guys' the cedars, the shovels. A lot of people know the snow shovels. So what are we looking at here? Yeah, so uh, we've got a little bit of everything down here this week. Everything that you see in red is our Earthway branded items. Those are designed for your fertilizer products. Everything in blue is designed for ice melt. Uh, it'll flow a little bit better with an oversized opening. So a little bit of something for everybody down here. Yeah. Uh, we've got our drop spreaders down here this year. We can't even keep those in the booth. I think we've already sold all of those. That's awesome. Shovels are always a hot commodity. I know those are one of your favorites. I love ours. We, so, we just put another order in for, what did I get, 30 pushers? 30 inch pushers? Uh, and 24s as Twi well. 24s. Yep. There you go. Uh, Earthway.com. Yep, Earthway.com. If you uh, get on there in the next two weeks, I know Brian's got uh, his code for the Brian's 10. That saves you guys 10% on anything you want. There you go. And, uh, Awesome. Hey, what, what's the number one selling uh, spreader? What uh, the, uh, is this the one I have back at home? Yep, this is the one that you guys have at home. That, That's right. Uh, your wife was doing some video work for us on <laughs> yeah. uh, earlier uh, this season, so we love to see that. I'm try I'm, we're trying to fix our lawn, right? <laughs> fix it. We're fixing the lawn. There you go. Yeah, uh, that, and that's one of our very, very popular ones at a good price point. Yep. It uh, treats well. It's got built-in side spread control, so you can shut off half of the hopper. Instead of using a deflector, it'll change your spread pattern to a 90 degree yep. instead of 180 degree. Uh, so Love it. It's a, a great little unit for uh, for all your commercial contractors and pros out there. There's And there's a lot more. The blue or ice melt, we've got one of these guys, too, for the ice melt. But 100% uh, love this thing. And um, I got can we show the shovels? Absolutely. Uh, tell me a little bit about these guys, if you don't mind, because... Uh, for anybody who's using like an old steel shovel or oh, something sure. from Home Depot. So we've got two different styles of shovels over here. The ones that you see with no ridges on them, these are snow pushers. They're yep. made out of a high quality UHMW plastic. Well, Nothing will stick to it. We can't even put a decal on them. That's right. Uh, they're so slick. So they do great. They roll the snow off the side just like a plow does. So just put on a little angle and head down your sidewalk. We've got those available in 24 inch, 30 inch, and 36 inch sizes. And then for your other guys, we've got the contractor shovel. This one's got the grooves on it. This one you can still launch snow with forward. It'll go up and over, but you can dig with these as well. They've all got uh, heavy duty fiberglass shafts. That's right. So you're not going to bend them. You're not going to break them. Very, very robust. Ergonomic D handle. They're super comfortable to use. That's right. And they're all made locally right in Bristol, Indiana. Love it, brother. All right. Well, there you go. Quick little uh, conversation. Earthway got the spreaders up top. Looking awesome. And uh, check out their booth if you guys are here. And uh, again, we'll leave links in the description for Earthway, but 100% one of my favorite brands to use, both for summer and for winter. So thanks, Mitch. Appreciate you. Not a problem. Have a good show, Brian. Yeah, it's really quick, folks. Kind of Tractor Tim, holy freaking cow. Stanley Dirt Monkey, he does exist. Holy freaking cow. <laughs> Stan, what's, uh, what's your best business, uh, business advice? My best business advice is to always be a student, never, ever stop learning and think you know it all because that's when you plateau. All right. If you always keep your mind open to new opportunities because there's more than one way to skin a cat, you'll always continue to grow. And that's all. Awesome. And always look for the opportunity in everything that you do. Stanley, what kind of beard oil do you use? Uh, I use Gillette. 
What kind do you use? I haven't grown a beard. This is me from high school, bro. It doesn't grow in. I, can't. I do shave my eyebrows, though. You want to check them out? Oh, yeah. I was going to say, you still have the wipe cut in your eyebrows for you, Brian? <laughs> yeah, I'm like, we're at a steel event, and I'm like, Brian, what happened to your eyebrows? And he's, he gets all conscientious. He's like, why? What's they wrong? They flare like, out. You don't have any. He's like, well, I let my wife cut them. I'm like, you let him cut them a little too short, didn't you there, buddy? That day, I think the razor blade flipped the other side. We used the three, not the six. Okay. It's the best I got, all right? All and right. the beard, I can't do it. I, I get I get the patchy chin and the mustache, but I can't get the side, so I don't know how. You marker, have to teach me your magic tricks. Marker. Magic marker. Ma magic marker. It'll look good on you. Get out of here. That's Daily Dirt Monkey. Uh, our content's a little bit more uh, right. polished and commercialized, right? That's what everybody will tell you. If you want the uncut, tell the world how it is kind of videos, I guess you yeah. gotta go check out Stan, yeah. right? Yeah. Everywhere I go, people are like, you know Stanley the Dirt Monkey? I go, I do. He's, he's awesome, and he's as crazy as you can imagine on video as in real life. Oh no, it's worse off video. <laughs> uh -huh. All right, over now, we'll catch up with you guys a little bit. All right, so Stanley Dirt Monkey, holy freaking cow. All right, where are we going next? Uh, we're gonna go check out the Honda booth in a second. They got some new stuff. Um, I get a lot of these emails that have like new product releases. So it's always cool seeing all that. So um, it's not like exclusive or anything super privy. So it's always cool just to see the latest and greatest. I, I love seeing, you cold? Yeah, sorry. Shaking there, I'm like, what the heck? Uh, really quick, let me turn around. Uh, John, your booth? Yeah. <laughs> All right, so here you go. Love seeing all the green, looking good, looking fresh. John Dude's always got a really beautiful booth, and I don't know, I'm like a moth to a flame. What's that? Can I get a sunshade for Armour? Uh, I think you can on the uh, X Mark, yeah. Yeah, the sunshade. This is like a fixed mount, though. This is like tractor grade quality kind of stuff, you know? That's pretty cool. There you go. Uh, I do was saying I'm a, a moth to a flame with the green lights under the mower decks, you know? Always looks really good. So, anyway, shout out to the JD team. And uh, let's go see if we can go bug Paul Jameson really quick. There you go. We got another celebrity over there. Paul Jameson. Hey How we doing, bud? There you go. Yeah. All right, over here at the right booth, we've got all their standards and the uh, right standard LG that came out, I think, maybe even last year. But always a beautiful booth and uh, just really good people. I love talking to Ed Wright. I don't think he's here right now. But uh, anyway, really, really quick, good product. If you guys need a gated backyard mower, I've always been a big advocate of the uh, standard I, the intensity, but you start with the standard B if you want, but for like two grand more, you might as well just get the intensity and uh, go with that for 30, 33, 36, 42, whatever it might be. I forget the sizes, but again, always great product and build quality, second to none. All right, so we're gonna go get a pretzel really quick at the food court. One thing I'll tell you guys, I never do in life, I've heard many people say this, and I've always tried to stay grounded. Please never read your own press clippings because if you do, you're gonna look like this. <laughs> out of banner. Like cyborg. <laughs> With this like manufactured double chin thing. So like, uh, I don't know what's going on with that. But this is for Energize. But we got Sam Gamble, Corey, and Sam Rankin. So that's gonna be really cool. But anyway, um, you think they could've got a better photo. <laughs> that's a Ugh. photo on all your books. That's a photo on our books. Milwaukee booth. <laughs> All right, so really quick, we're about to do the X Mark takeover. Holy cow, there's already people in line. Low key, I get nervous and freak out every time because I'm just telling you guys honestly, it's not my personality type to go meet 200 people. Um, if you guys come up and say, hey, thank you so much for showing love, um, and just keep telling everybody at X Mark that we're awesome. Because <laughs> I don't know if we really are, but you guys make us awesome, so it really means the world. That's all I got. All right, we're gonna jump on in and uh, get to hopefully meet as many of you guys as possible. So, always seriously appreciate you guys. It's kind of weird. We did not start any YouTube stuff for this kind of meet and greet, if you will, but I so appreciate the opportunity to serve you guys, love on you guys, pour into the whole industry as much as I can. So, when you guys come up and shake my hand, just know you're making my world. So, all right, let's keep going for it. No, no. Why are you gonna cry? Shut up. I'm like already losing my mind. Why are you gonna cry? I will say this I will pay you $1,000 right now for a chapstick. <laughs> If you have a chapstick, I will take it right now. Uh, your, your girl lip balm, that's not gonna work. All right, let's go jump to the booth.
Yeah. Booth. There's so many great things going on here. And Equip Expo 2024. Talk about a great time. Y'all oh, are fantastic. And All right, guys. So really quick here. Just got done hanging out at the Billy Go booth. Hanging out with a friend of mine, Nathan from Wisconsin. What's up, brother? Hey, how are you doing? Doing good. Uh, you're actually part of our Link membership. Is that right? I'm part of the Link membership. Oh, I think we got to come over here for a quick second. They're getting ready to video. Once again, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. All right, gentlemen. so I don't want to get in the way of Ferris and Briggs and everything they got going on. But you're part of the Link membership. I am. Quick little testimony. Leave the name of the brand out. Yeah, but you bet. What do we do to save you? So I uh, was looking at a new mower purchase and I posted a question on the Link membership uh, about this uh, mower that I was going to purchase and asking questions, quality, is it a good idea? And I got a ton of feedback from the group, from the members in the group, from Brian himself, about not only uh, that it wasn't a good decision to purchase it, but why. And and it's not like being part of the other groups on Facebook where you get chastised for asking a simple question and you never even get a quality answer. So in this particular case, this probably saved me from making a $13,000 mistake on something that everybody else is already trying to do. Yeah, I was so glad that that all worked out for you because I was like, oh, a good brand, don't buy that mower, and uh, you ended up buying a different mower. Yes, yep, yeah. absolutely. So people are like twenty nine dollars a month. Brian's in it for the money. I'm like, it's nothing like that, bro. Like it's a community that can help you win. So anyway, thanks for the testimony. Yeah. Love you, man. You join the show? Absolutely. All right, cool. All right, let's get out of the way of the Vanguard, but uh, we'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. And I'm going to let each of them introduce themselves a little bit to you, and then we're going to have a really good discussion for about forty minutes or so. All right, we got the Bobcat booth. Heck yeah, I'll be circling back. They get me a Bobcat Tractor 2035. What do you think? Okay. All right, let's go. Okay. And, uh, All right, guys, so really quick, look at this hat. That's from the LMN team over here. They got a little brew crew uh, action here. It's actually pretty dope. Uh, some of you guys have seen my story the last nine months. Yeah. Signed up with LMN. It's not for everyone, although I do think it is for everyone. But my point is, if you have a quarter million dollar business or above, I think it's for you and above, and you have to check it out. Before that, Rock and roll with Yardbook. After that, get a handle on your numbers and go with Element. I'm just telling you. And plus, Element comes with that guy. Okay, that's all you need to know. It's Mark Bradley. He's awesome. So, all right, I got the cool hat. Look at the hat. I got two hats. I got two hats. All right, really quick. There's the uh, Razorback. John, how we doing? Morning, brother. There's the Arctic sectionals. I need to get a ten and a half uh, box on a skid. And so, Liz, what do you think? Can I spend some money? Come on. It's only like probably eight grand. Only eight grand. Only eight grand that we probably don't have. <laughs> spend eight grand going into winter. But you got to spend money to make money. Isn't that what they say? Yeah. There you go. I was able to talk to the um, Earth and Turf? Earth, Earth and Turf guys. I'm going to hopefully come back and shoot a quick video. So, stay tuned for that. All right, guys, so over here, cutting through. <laughs> yeah, I'm just throwing him on the video. I don't care what he says. My brother from another mother, Mr. Cornell. What's going on, homie? Uh, hanging in there, bro. How are you? I'm great. I ain't got nothing to complain about except for being a little tired. I've been really yeah. busy this week. I'm trying to, like, pump up the energy for the camera, but admittedly, I did not sleep one bit last night. We're in these hotel rooms. I don't care, like, how nice they are. They all still smell like smoke, a little dank, you know? But it is what it is. You got to put on your happy face. <laughs> so, hey, your meetup tonight, uh, how many people are scheduled to go? Uh, 240 so far, um, but it's growing. What is it called? So anybody who doesn't know, if they don't make it this year, maybe they're watching the videos, but like, gosh darn it, I'm making sure I make Equip 2025, and they want to register, what do you guys got going on? Uh, the Win in Life meetup, it's down here every year. This year we're going to have Stanley Dirt Monkey there, Johnny Blaze of Grass, Keith Kalfas, John Page, Jack Naylor, Talia Farrow, you name them, they're going to be there. Name one, you got to name them one. I just named about six of them. So. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, but it's going to be 240 plus people there uh, for this year. Next year it'll be bigger. The venue that I use called Vernon Lanes can hold up to 600 people. So we have room to grow there. Uh, and it's a bowling event. Yeah. You know, it's going to be fun. Comp healthy competition is what I always say. We always want to have each other pushing each other so that we can get to our next level. This is what this guy has done for me, and uh, it's what I try and do for him now, so. Uh, the feeling's mutual, that's why I always love, anytime I capture you, I, I'm like, hey, I need to get you on video. Like, I love the energy and the vibes, and you make me feel like a better person, man, every time. I, I, I always walk Aww. around, I'm like, I love that guy, man, he's a good dude, you know? Um, Win at Life Meetup, yep. that's the, uh, the name of the event, so we'll plug links in the description. If you didn't make it this year, no big deal. Make it next year. Yeah, for sure. All right, what's one thing you're excited about seeing at the show, and then I'll let you uh, get back at it. 
I want to see, I got to look at the new uh, mowers. I got to get a 52 for next year. Okay. And I'm going to be moving on to like a ramp rack system on my new Ford F-350. So cool. Um, I'm looking to look at lawn mowers. There you go. All right, brother. Well, hey, enjoy the show. Always good seeing you. Keep the positive attitude. Check out his YouTube channel, uh, Mac underscore landscaping 412 on Instagram. It's almost like I follow you, bro. I know. I know. I like, I know all your stuff, man. So <laughs> which way? Appreciate you. And uh, we'll catch up with you sooner, right? Peace. All right, here we go. Brakes doing their thing, but get that Ferris mower. I think they're giving one or two of these away. There you go. I uh, sixty two hundred. Wow, that's huge. There you go. Got their walk behind. And you recommend to all our They got the Michelin man up there. That's awesome. I hope you guys can see. There you go. Oh, that's so funny. Get ready to be electrified as Energize is here to get you through the midday slump. These panelists and hosts are business owners like you and are here to offer their perspectives and direction on your challenges. Join me in welcoming to the stage Brian Fullerton. You guys gotta realize, I did not get started doing social media to speak in front of 400 of the sharpest people I've ever met in my entire life. All of you guys, I'm telling you what, I'm just a regular guy out there trying to build a lawn landscape company in Metro Detroit, Michigan. Just trying to figure it out along the way just like so many of you. We've done a little bit along the way with social media, kind of put us out front on some different things. Evan tapped me on the shoulder a couple of years ago and said, hey, would you like to host this new breakout sales and marketing session called Energize? And I said, absolutely not. <laughs> Is anybody out there a public speaking aficionado? Who likes public speaking? Raise, raise your hands. There's one, two, three psychopaths. <laughs> I'll tell you guys what, uh, a lot of people know introvert, extrovert personality types. I'm an introvert. This is not my cup of tea. I get nervous. So if you guys uh, can just give me a little bit of latitude today and these great speakers, we would appreciate that. Nobody who's a professional speaker. We're just like you guys. You know, back on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday next week, we're gonna be answering service calls, bidding sites, and getting work done, just like all of you guys. Really quick, before we get started here, I just wanna say a big welcome and thank you to not only you guys, but the Energize and Equip Expo team giving us this stage. I don't take this for granted. It's a big responsibility, so I just wanna say thank you to them and them just hosting a first class event. Can you guys give me a big song and give them a round of applause before we get started? All things being said, Energize, we want to talk to you guys about sales and marketing. We want to talk to you guys about right, what do you want to say? Let's go, let's go. Give a round of applause. Come on, back to Iowa, keep the applause going. We got Sam Redmond, Ed Childer over there in beautiful Iowa. Bring them on up, guys. A round of applause. And last but not least, we got the heavy hitter. We got my team move, John Maxwell. Mr. Sam Gemmel, Atlas Outdoor. Bring him on up, everybody. Alright, this is what we got here. Sam Gemmel, I'm in the middle. Well, we've been talking lawnmowers the whole freaking uh, video, but here you guys go. You got your boss Snow Raider, the SR Mag. Love this. A little big for us, but love it. Now, this right here is something I am thinking about picking up. If not this season, next season. If this would have came out before we bought our uh, straight blade for our Polaris four-wheeler, this is what I would have went with instead. Uh, probably 10, 12 grand. I, I'm not sure the price point. Just a little bit of a uh, stripped down video or stripped down products compared to uh, the Snow Raider, if you will. So, show you guys what else we got going on in here. They got the new Boss V-Box spreader. This is what we have on order. Ours is coming in. Uh, should be literally getting installed next week. So, I don't know everything about it just yet, admittedly. We'll learn and uh, do some videos with it as we go. But there you go, here's the brand new spreader. Looking good. All right, so go figure. Here's the case booth. Uh, Jeremy with Glacier. You know, turn this on to all this stuff. Only world out there. Troy Clark's doing this. Everybody's doing this, right? So we can figure it out too, right? Absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, 321F, maybe a 10 and a half sectional. This right here is exactly what I want. I want to get one of these, maybe two of these, sooner than later, because we have a lot of commercial sites coming online. And hopefully a lot of snow. <laughs> and hopefully a lot of snow to go with it, right? So 
Anyway, really quick, just want to show you guys the case booth and uh, show you guys everything they got going on. Right. Hey, really quick, all right. I think we got to wrap this vlog up eventually. I always see my brother from another mother, Mr. Sean Spencer. Where's he at? Where's he at? I don't see him anywhere <laughs> there right There you here. go. Hey, a quick <laughs> expo. We've been talking. There's so many people here. We're just hanging out. The show is pretty much wrapping up. Quick expo 2024, good time? Amazing, man. Blessed once again. Year 10? Yeah. Like that. Long yeah. time for me. I, you've been coming way longer than I have. 14, yeah. Um, yeah, is that right? Minus a year, COVID. Yeah. Right, right, right. Uh, this is my seventh or something year, but it gets bigger and bigger every time. So, what was your favorite favorite thing or favorite takeaway? 100% just meeting everybody, hanging out. I haven't filmed a single thing other than a few Instagrams. Yeah. Didn't break the camera out this year. Just took it all in. And... Here, well, well, I, here I am trying to film videos. I have no idea what I'm doing here. <laughs> He's a professional. I'm just making stuff up. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, uh, appreciate your brother. Just want to say hey really quick. You got here? Yeah. Remember, SpencerProducts.com. Uh, I'm over here trying to plug Brian. I need some money to get invested into this thing. We, we want to go big or go home. So. Well, you got a lot of land and property and uh, big dreams and ambitious. This is uh, my, my, my businessman over here. You're my, my, my financial coach, right? So I'm just going to give it all to you. Yeah, I'll, be, I'll invoice you right now. Well, we make those YouTube millions. You don't need any money. <laughs> it's hard out here, you know? That's right, brother. That's right. All right. Hey, appreciate you. Yep, absolutely. All right, guys. Let's button it up. All right, guys. So walking out of Equip Expo, and I had to turn on the camera really quick because there's a massive FedEx shipping airplane that's freaking flying over. And it wouldn't be a Brian's Law Maintenance YouTube video without an, an airplane. airplane. That's the truth. I don't know what it is. <laughs> they just find you. They literally find me, or I'm always by an airplane. I don't know. But Jeremiah Jennings, how are you? What's up, man? Doing good. You have a good Quip. show? Yeah. There you uh, go. Kill all those fast goes by. Coach your outro for my outro. <laughs> 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 a dual outro. Um, favorite thing from the show? Anything cool? I uh, saw a lot of good stuff today. Um, just the, getting to see everybody catch up. There you go. What's the Relco? Yeah, Roco. So that's rebrand. Kohler's rebrand there. Oh, uh, is that what that is? Yeah. Okay. Oh. Yeah, Kohler's rebrand. So there looking go. good. Yeah, I did a cool giveaway over there. Uh, new engine release. So you'll see all that coming in 2025. Love it, man. Love it. Not going to lie. I could use chapstick, a Red Bull, and probably another eight hours of sleep. Yeah. It is a, an exhausting couple of days, but got to meet so many great folks. Um, got to hang out at the Mark Bradley Element. Group. Yeah. Element, Element was great. Oh, here's another airplane. But uh, yeah, Element was great. Talked about the new crew app coming out in 20, or really in the next months they're going to be giving some good updates so looking forward to it that is the largest ups if you didn't hear that jeremiah says he owes me a thousand dollars with late fees compounded with interest the huge ups uh usps U -U uh, UPS, UPS. Uh, airplane. But anyway, all right. Well, hope you guys enjoyed the show. Hope you guys enjoyed the footage. Anything I can grab for you, I'm doing my best to just whip through, grab as much content yeah. as possible. But um, it's a really, really good time. Appreciate you guys. Uh, drop a like if you want. And uh, over and out. Have a great day, guys. We'll see, see you guys.